Iranian women and girls have been playing a leading role in this movement against the oppressive and sexist regime. And that regime has persisted for 44 years. That's too long. Everyone has the right to choose who is their political leader, who is the one who, who, who will fight for their rights, who will stand up for their rights. And here it is, Mrs. Rayavi, of course. There you are. Great to see you. Strength of the Iranian protesters is, to me, it is admirable. I truly admire your strength. Because you literally risk your lives to obtain rights that you deserve, fundamental rights. The Iran's regime is, um, and you all know it, the current world record holder on execution. We've seen the pictures of all the girls when we came in here. And I would like to pronounce my deep respect to all the families of those who lost their lives, just gave their lives for a better future for others. On this International Women's Day, I really want to honor you, to honor, to honor all brave Iranian women who played a significant role in the uprising. But I also want to honor the National Council's Council of Resistance of Iran. Because yes, with half of its members being a woman and responsible for many of its committees, you do struggle for freedom and equality.